just finished number two. Uh, I think y'all seen this one a couple weeks ago. It looks like it's bounced back a little bit since the rain. We got a little bit of rain now. Anyway, we're on the way to number three. Uh, y'all can see number three. Just a little bit tall. So it really has grown since the rain. Um, so but we'll get it knocked down. There we go. We got it knocked back down. Looking halfway decent. But, uh, yeah. One more. We on the way now. Y'all see number three. Got a few lines in it. Skag put a few stripes down. Um, it was a little bit thick, so I double cut it. The front. Uh, kind of double cut the back too to get some of the straw up. Pushed over into wood line. So, uh, yeah. What's up, guys? Just got back in the yard. Um, it is 10 30, 10 35. Um, You uh, know, four yards. Through 15 miles. Um, one of those I had to kind of, I, I was thinking about something else and I missed my turn, so I kind of had to go around in a loop. So some of those are me going around in the loop and then making my way back. Uh, just mine was on something else at the time. And uh, I do that sometimes when I'm driving. Um, my mind on something else and just get where I'm going. Uh, I don't know, that probably ain't a good thing, but sometimes I'll forget to miss a turn or go right by where I'm supposed to turn and, you know, have to double back. But that's what I did this morning. I had my mind on something else, something totally different, and I uh, had to double back. But, uh... Got it done. Uh, 260 bucks, four yards, 15 miles on a truck. I mean, probably the mower's got a half tank of fuel in it still. So it was full. Uh, well, it was full yesterday when we did the salon. So course that's a bigger property so we got a half a tank of fuel uh, probably about what it had this morning still they wasn't big properties y'all see them on the y'all will see them uh, in the video they wasn't big properties didn't do an intro this morning didn't talk to y'all this morning and I uh, was gonna get y'all some mowing footage but seen to misplace my tripod uh, yesterday so but I'll work on getting another one of those and uh, maybe it'll be a little bit better one. I know y'all y'all fallen over a couple times. So maybe we get a little bit better quality uh, tripod that'll you know, stand up and uh, might find one that goes a little bit taller actually too. Um, when I try to do my hunts, um, I have to put the tripod on top of something so might try to find one I can set in the floor of the stand and it'll go up, you know, high enough so y'all can see out, see what I'm seeing without having to put y'all on top of, without having to set the tripod on top of something and try to balance it. I might try to find a little bit better tripod that's a little bit taller. Uh, the one I had was cheap. Uh, I think like 10 bucks or something from Best Buy. So it wasn't a, uh, wasn't the best quality uh, anyway, and uh, may try to find one that I can hold the 
put the uh, tablet on so uh, I can still listen to whatever I want to listen to while I'm mowing it and still get y'all some uh, some footage. So um, I usually listen to podcasts is what I typically listen to. Um, you know, uh, usually stuff like uh, there's a few uh, podcasts about NASCAR. I listen to those um, just to hear what went on during the week and, and whatnot. Um, and a few, uh, a few of the lawn care guys uh, have some podcasts out. I listen to a little bit of those, or, but some of them, most of them, a lot of them are somebody trying to sell you something. So, you know, then I listen to uh, a couple other podcasts along the way. Uh, but the lawn care ones that I found to be really good are... Uh, there's one called Turf Wars. There's two guys. Uh, they're uh, real close to each other in Kentucky. And uh, I think they're in next counties, towns next to each other. So they're somewhat competitors, but then they're somewhat friends too. So that really, that really interests me. Y'all know how much I like to go out and help uh, my fellow man. Uh, with his jobs and stuff. So that one's kind of interesting. And uh, it kind of goes along, you know, I don't know, I hadn't dove real deep, but me and Chris kind of developed a kind of a brotherhood, I guess, um, over the last couple years. So um, we're probably more like brothers than we are just uh, just friends. So uh, we got, we've got some of the same interest in, uh, you know, besides lawn care, we got some of the same interest. Um, he likes to hunt, um, fish, whatever. So, you know, we got some of the same interest there. And, uh, but, uh, anyway, that one I really like. Um, but, you know, just some of what I listen to, podcasts. Don't list, listen to much music anymore. Pretty much listen to, you know, I don't get much out of listening to music. Uh, listen to a few books, um, stuff like that. I got a few audio books that I downloaded. I listen to them occasionally. You know, usually once or twice a season, I'll go back and listen to some of the books. Um, y'all let me know what y'all like to listen to. If y'all listen to music a lot, or I mean, what y'all like to hear. Uh, if there's any good podcast out there that y'all listen to, let me know. Um, any good audio books that I, uh, that are informative, um, that y'all may have got a lot out of, let me know that, you know, let me know what they are, and, uh, but other than that, I ain't got much to talk about, went and did our work, uh, we're back at the house, it's, you know, time to go in here and get ready to go work for the man, um, it's that time again, Monday through Friday. So it was Monday again. Uh, but uh, anyway, we working on that. You know, we're going to keep doing this as long as we can. I um, hope we don't have to make a decision no time soon about quitting one or the other. Um, but we'll keep doing what we're doing as long as we can. And, uh, because certainly, y'all know in the days, the more money you got coming in, the better, the better you are for sure. So, uh, as long as I can keep doing both of them and giving them a hundred, give them a hundred percent of both of them, we're gonna keep going. Anyway, it is a grind, and it, but hey, September now. Uh, noticed a lot of straw in the last one. A lot of leaves starting to fall. So probably the next couple weeks I'll be putting my mulching blades on. Um, I got to order some more. Um, trying to decide do I want to order the Skag OEM mulching blades or I want to order something aftermarket um, or whatnot. But uh, last year I run an aftermarket set and they were pretty good and I run a Skag OEM set and they were both pretty good. Uh, just depends on I guess what I can get for the best 
what's the best quality for the best price? Uh, I will tell you, the Skag set, uh, I was not able to sharpen, but the aftermarket set, after I ran them, I was able to sharpen. So they might go back on the mower and might get another uh, leaf season out of those. Uh, but I'm probably gonna order two more sets and just keep those old ones on standby. Uh, but we'll see what I think about the next couple days. I'll let y'all know. But, uh, anyway, that's it. Hope everybody had a great weekend. Appreciate y'all watching. Uh, y'all take care of yourselves and uh, we'll catch you on the next one.